In this episode, we're gonna take a look on the game called The Grun. If you will be more interested in this game, you can come to this developer's page and there are like additional footage from the full version. Full version isn't available yet, the game is not like finished. But uh, there is a demo and a bit later we will take a look on the demo. So yes, there are like some clips, additional clips outside the demo. But what's the cool about this game is that the developer actually states that the game has like a sentimental meaning for him because it is a part of his like childhood. Hey everyone, I'm Tom from Sockpop. I made a very normal gardening game called Grun. You play as a gardener that gets hired to work on a garden deep in the Dutch countryside. It is a simple task. There's grass to be cut and hedges to be trimmed. But when you look closer, things will seem off. The game is inspired by a small town where my father lives. And the garden you work on is actually his garden. Please note that you only have two days to complete the job. And that you should not go out after dark. A free demo version is out now on Steam. Okay, let's take a look on the demo. Demo starts where protagonist is at his bus stop, so first impressions. As you see, graphics are quite low level, even for me, as I had played the retro style games like Eclipsium, but there everything were more darkish and objects didn't look that cheap. Okay, I know it's kinda specific art style, so it isn't in favor for my taste. So I had to find the key for the gate and look at this moment. I take the key and hops, the rose background picture is saved and sticked in front of the text line. And it gets even worse. The next info card they found was larger and even less can be seen. So basically I missed out all the story of the demo due to this. From task side, player had to cut grass and hedge, eliminate molehills, pick up trash and water the flowers. In the process, there happened some weird things, dwarf figurine is moving by itself, some weird noises happen, and at uh, one point there was something bigger. But I had to be honest, for me it was enough with demo. As I mentioned, the graphics is pain. If you play on large screen, it just look cheap, large chunks of blocks, you know, even Minecraft has like thousand times better graphics, but that might not be the main point here, something feels is lacking for um, art style, I think color should be adjusted, maybe different tones, and something with light seems off. And then that bug with those item cards just is like second big nail in the coffin for that game in my eyes. You might think differently, so if that's the case, go check it out, maybe it's the right game for you.